Welcome back to the Kathy Raley Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Sam Murray, joined now with Stevenson Women's Lacrosse head coach Kathy Raley. And coach, you earned the top seed in the upcoming Mac Commonwealth playoffs, won a perfect 8-0. It's the second time you've done that since joining the conference. Mm -hmm. For starters, let's talk about that last game where you, you, you've you secured that top seed against Messiah, okay. who, who's kind of gotten the best of you over the yeah, years. Kind of. Um, <laughs> and may not be the same Messiah team yeah. this year, but you held them scoreless for the last 40 minutes of play. Talk about that game. You know, I think it has a lot to do with team chemistry right now. Um, we, we make a lot of mistakes, but we make great mistakes and we're always ready to back each other up on those mistakes. So when I look at holding a, a great team like Messiah to zero goals and a half um, and, and, and the all over win with that game, what I'm seeing in there is, you know, maybe, maybe one of our players missed a slide, but the other player was there to cover for her. Makes it very hard on a potent attack and Messiah has a potent attack. Um, to, to find the gaps because we cover for our mistakes so, so very quickly. Um, I really think that the combination we have out there defensively right now, um, they play hard for each other. They, um, they scout really, really well. They're extremely intelligent. And I think whatever I'm asking them to do, they're executing. And not only are they executing, but they're executing at a high level. That was a really exciting half for us uh, for, for a lot of reasons. You know, we're shooting the ball a ton. Um, and as we get better with our shooting percentage, I think it's going to be even more and more difficult to stop us. So I'm, I'm really excited to see where the season leads us. You had a lot of standouts this year yes. on the field. Five of them earned all conference. I'm so freshman, yes. freshman Caroline Murphy yes. was the rookie of the year. And then she was also on the second team. Mm -hmm. And then Carly Bowes. Uh, Gabby DeGella, Sarah Rorty, Mac Ferguson, yes. all first team mm -hmm. selections. Just talk about that. Oh goodness, I, you know what a what a positive reflection of our team um, to be, have so many on on that list. Uh, you know, starting with Caroline, just to watch her progression as the season has go, gone on, and her confidence um, has been truly, truly exciting. And you know, a lot of those attackers are so very big, uh, such a big deal in in, in how we redefend and how we get our, our defense a chance to get a break and uh, you know they all work so so very well together Car you know Caroline's a, a, a double threat she can shoot and she can feed and she occupies oftentimes one of the other team's best defenders and still is putting in numerous goals so I'm, I'm very proud of that combination of uh, you know, Mac Sarah and Gabby um, you know it's just it's it's a wow factor uh, they get along great. They're super supportive of each, of each other. Uh, and I think that they, they just have so much fun on defense. And, and you can see the excitement and you can see um, that they try different things. You can also see that they get better and better as the game goes on. Uh, nothing makes a coach happier that as that game goes on, they, they rectify whatever mistakes they were making early on. Their energy level increases. Their communication increases. And it's just been so fun to watch that defensive that defensive trio move forward you know carly bows i i just think carly is one of the best players in the country and and i and i really hope that she gets recognized for that down the road um she's she's not only a great attacker uh, but carly is an exceptional part of that defense as well you know i i give carly usually the toughest mark out on the field um, unless that player is a super low player low attacker um, she just holds everybody. She holds everybody. It's you can't take her in the one v one very easily. And and if you do, we're we're ready uh, and there to help her. So um, you know her 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 being on the field is just invaluable. So I, I'm so glad to see that all five were recognized so positively. And um, I you know I think it's great for our team. Great re recognition for our team. And getting back to the field, you have a max semifinal yes. contest against. Fifth seed at Widener, yes. who upset Albright mm -hmm. uh, in the first round game. You defeated the Pride twenty to twelve in the first mm -hmm. first meeting. Their high scoring team. It's their first first playoff win in their thirty nine per year <laughs> history. It really? So you know, I yeah. think they they're excited. They feel the fire. What's the what are the keys of the game? You know that that the the coach at Widener has done a really good job. I think the key is understanding how to play left handers. I think what they do is is something that we don't see on a regular basis as within the conference or even even out of conference games. Having two left-handers, uh, you have to change your defensive strategy. 
And I think early on in games, sometimes um, that's difficult to kind of get used to and get in the flow of. Um, they have the offensive player of the year. You know, obviously uh, she can score goals and, and she's an equal threat with feeding. We've slowed her down before. I fully expect that we'll slow her down again. Uh, we'll make the adjustments that we didn't make in the first game with dealing with a second left-hander. We've gotten a lot better in their stack play. Um, I think it's going to come down to how we handle their defense. You know, in, in the game that we played them um, back in a couple weeks ago, I can't remember how long ago it was, you know, we shot the ball 53 times. I don't know if we've ever shot the ball 53 times. So we got to make a lot more of those shots if we want to win this game. So um, we got to make sure we're moving the, the keeper. I thought the keeper was, was the most dynamic part of the ga their game the last time we saw them. And, you know, we've been practicing all week to make sure that uh, we're ready for her. Well, Coach, we wish you the best of luck on Wednesday and, and moving forward. Thank you very much. For head coach Kathy Raley, I'm Sam Murray, and this has been the Kathy Raley Show.